Authorities in Isabela prepare contingency measures as Tropical Storm Helen may make landfall in the area. We have David Santos reporting live from Santiago City, Isabela. David? Pia, the weather condition in this part of central and eastern Luzon from the expressway just outside Metro Manila to where we are now here in Santiago City remained overcast with uh, occasional rains. The same is true is in Isabela and Cagayan, both reporting that they have experienced mostly cloudy skies throughout the day, even if they have been placed under storm signal number two. There are some areas, though, that experience intermittent downpour. In Nueva Ecija, for example, some towns only had light to moderate rains around past noon, but parts of San Jose City experienced heavy rains, causing a minor rock slide in the Barangay Tayabo Highway, slowing down traffic in that area. Local government units of both Isabela and Cagayan have assured that contingency measures have been in place even if they have yet to experience the direct effect of Tropical Storm Helen's strength. Aside from having rescue and disaster response teams on round-the-clock alert, relief goods have also been prepositioned for evacuation centers. Overall, Pia, most areas in this part of Region 2 are covered with heavy clouds. Well, as the saying goes, there is calm before the storm. Pia? Thank you, David Santos, reporting live from Cagayan, from Isabella.